Hey, Connie Knox here, genealogist for Genealogy TV, uh, helping you go further faster factually with your family research. Today's Tiny Tip Tuesday is about what to do with the photographs that you take while you're at the archives and how to file them properly. One of the tips that I like to do, I have come home and I've got two dozen photographs on my cell phone from documents that I have taken while I was at the archives. One of the things that I like to do is I like to uh, embed those into a Word document and take notes about what I found, even if it's just a couple sentences, and where I found them. These photographs are copied and taken in the North Carolina State Archives in Raleigh, the original photographs I shot on location uh, in my digital archives and where I got them located. So those um, actual images are attached now to my notes and I've also got a footer with my personal information on it. I've got uh, a master head with the, the uh, the header on it and I'll keep a boilerplate of these note-taking footer and header just as a generic template so that I can open it quickly I have a consistency in the way I format my notes I go in there and I can change this for the next set uh, pretty quickly type my notes up real quick and sometimes I'll even dictate them in a microphone if I don't feel like typing a lot and just polish it up and then uh, save it. Again, as you, if you've seen my um, fi good filing habits from the start video, it talks about uh, how to name your files and uh, I always use the surname in, in caps followed by the first name and then a description of what it is and preferably a year attached in the file name itself. That way the notes, the photographs and everything are all located in the same place. So there's your tiny tip for this Tuesday. Hope you enjoyed it. Hey, I hope you enjoyed watching that episode on Genealogy TV. If you'd like to help support Genealogy TV for as little as a dollar a month, you can do so at patreon.com forward slash genealogy TV. Also, you should know in the show notes, there are links. Occasionally, those are affiliate marketing links. Uh, to products that pay me a small commission. That also helps support the station, but doesn't cost you a dime extra. So you should know that up front so that you know that using those links helps support the channel. So if you find something in there that is useful, um, please use the links. It really does help me out a lot. I appreciate it so much. Thanks for watching Genealogy TV, and thanks for your support.